This dress is perfect. I remember wearing it to my junior prom last year. I will wear this to a fancy restaurant in Charlotte. I look very dolly in my dress. That dress is much better for you. You need to pack that inside your suitcase. It's perfect for you to wear to Charlotte. I love it, Dad. I'll take this off and pack it in my suitcase. That's my girl. You look stunning, just like you did at prom last year. I got everything I need. I am all set. There you go, Sarah. I hope this trip goes well, honey. However, me too, honey. Let's get rolling. Today on day one, South Park Mall. Hey, that Walmart looks different from the one we have at home. It does. I guess every town has its own style. We're not going there, but it looks different though. We are going this way to get some gas and drinks. Sounds like there are politics going on, Sarah. Hey! My name is Joshua! Sarah, what's the matter with you? Oops, sorry, kiddo. Gee whiz, is everybody on the entire last minute wrong? It's Joshua, not Sarah. It's Joshua. J O S H U A Sarah. Oh, uh, or, or great. Now I'm mixed up. I don't know who I am. Okay, we are now here in Charlotte. We finally arrived. Now we are at Cheesecake Factory. After this, we will walk around the mall after dinner. That is a good idea, Dad. I want to buy something from Lululemon. Lululemon, that store is too expensive, but I guess you can. Just be careful how much you spend. Hopefully, the food will be at this table as soon as possible. I love my new leggings and black tank tops I got from Lululemon. I'm wearing it before we leave to go home in two days. I'm so happy you got that you got. Anyways, we can now check in our hotel room. This hotel room looks elegant. I guess you could save that, Sarah. Sarah, tomorrow you will be putting on your dress because we are going somewhere fancy. We're going to Top Golf first, but you can just wear it to Top Golf. I don't really mind, Mom. I feel elegant in it anyway. I love the way how it feels. I will exactly look dolly wearing it. Anyways, it is time for bed. We will have lots of fun tomorrow. All right, today we are going to see Carolina Panthers at the Bank of America Stadium. We will have hot dogs there for lunch. After that, we will be back here. I'll get my phone out to pull up the tickets in order to get in the game. Indeed, they play against Kansas City Chiefs. I hope Carolina wins. However, we can now go. <laughs> Woohoo! Carolina Panthers won this game today. We are so happy. We all had hot dogs for lunch. The game went very well. Awesome. Can we go back to the hotel, Mom and Dad? Of course. We can now go back right now. I look stunning in that dress. I already wore it at prom last year, and now I'm wearing it again. I love how it feels and how great I look. I will now show Mom and Dad. Oh, Sarah, you look absolutely beautiful. That dress is stunning on you. Wow, you are going to turn heads tonight. 
Kiddo, you look like a million bucks. Thanks, I mean, it is not exactly a golf outfit, it's my prom dress, which I wore to junior prom last year. Don't let it slow down your golf swing. I'll manage, don't worry, let's go have some fun. I must look the most elegant dolly girl ever seen while golfing at Top Golf. All right, Sarah, let's see what you got. Just remember, it's all in the swing. You go, girl. Wow, I'm very proud of Sarah. A perfect hole in one. Yay! I made it perfect hole in one. I got extra points. What part of city is this? Just a neighborhood all the citizens drive by. This is so weird. This is still a highway, but with houses right beside us we are passing. We are now heading back to downtown, and we will now dine in at a fancy restaurant. The fancy restaurant will be our last place, because tomorrow morning at 8, we will go home. Today is Sunday, and you have no school because of Labor Day. Indeed, we will leave tomorrow at 8 o'clock. We will spend one more night here. I'm so sorry! He ran out so quickly, I didn't see him in time! Sure, it does a fiction in this day! You need to pay attention! Madam, we are so sorry. It was an accident, and we're glad your son is alright. We are from out of town. It's okay, buddy. I got you. You people don't belong here! If you kill him, you'll be down! Sarah, where are you going? Hey, little one. It's okay. You're safe now. You! You bitch! You do not talk to her like that! Daddy! You do not ever say that word! You are about to get soap in your mouth, young man! Don't you ever come back to Charlotte ever again, do you? Fuck you. Dad! Memphis, I can't say the B word! You said a bad word to that dolly girl! You're about to get soap in your mouth, young man! You do not ever say that word! You okay, Sarah? I'm fine. I didn't expect that to happen. Sarah, honey, what's wrong? I tried to help, and he called me a B-word. I'm so sorry he said that to you. <laughs> it's okay to feel hurt, but that little boy is just a little toddler. He does not understand what cuss words are. He does not know. I'm sorry this happened to you, Sarah. You are my only girl. It is all good, Sarah. We will forget about it and focus on getting to dinner very soon. looks very scary. We might change our plans tonight. Baby girl, it's okay that you screamed. We will just pack up and go home after dinner somewhere fancy. I don't think we are staying tonight. We will just leave later and go home when we get done with dinner. I can't stand this place. After we pay for our meal and tip, we are going to walk back to the hotel and grab all our stuff, check out, and hit the road so we can go home. I can't wait to get home after rough stuff on this trip. After we leave, I'm going to be ready to go home. Don't worry, Sarah. We will be home around midnight or even one. Right now is 821, so we must finish up and get out of here. Mom and Dad, let's get out of here. What the fuck? Dude! You can't do that! Why would you do that? You listen to me! You just crossed the line and you will regret for the rest of your life! Hand over your phone! Now! I didn't mean to do it. It was an accident. My phone lost control. Don't lie to me, dude! 
We saw him put his phone under her dress. The cops are already coming to arrest him. Don't worry, you're free to go, guys. Have a good night, sir. Sir, you are under arrest for recording inappropriate footage. I didn't do anything wrong. It was a misunderstanding. Apology not for you. We are taking you down to the station. Get in the police car right now. All I wanted to see is what it looks like under her dress. Damn you folks. All right, family, we are now leaving. Let's go down to the elevator, check out, and get to the car. All right, everyone in. We will stop for gas and drinks on the way home if anyone needs something. Hey, man, I don't know who you are, but we are hitting the road for our three-hour ride back home. So, please back off. Have a good night. I want to date that dolly girl that is dolled up in the dress to be my girlfriend. Get the hell away from me and my family! You don't talk about my daughter like that, ever! Now get the fuck away from this car before I call the police! She is so hot. So long, pervert! Damn it, that's the girl I really wanted. We have finally left Charlotte. We have three hours to go until we get home. I am excited to be home. Thank God we have left Charlotte. Now we are on the road on the way home. This is the last time we will ever take road trips. We are staying in our hometown, for now on, at home. At least I still have on my dress. I feel very happy wearing it, especially for a long ride back home. Indeed Sarah, you are the most elegant passenger ever seen on the highway. Screw that stranger, he made me very uncomfortable in the parking garage. Thank God we left him behind, and now focused getting home. It's okay Sarah, we are not in Charlotte anymore, since we just left and now headed home. Let's move on, we have 3 hours and 2 minutes to get home. Home sweet home, I'm happy to be home. Let's go to bed and we will unpack tomorrow back inside the house. We need a lot of rest after two days of this nonsense. Good night, Dad. Good night, Sarah. And also, are you sure you don't want to change into something more comfortable? No, I love this dress. It means a lot to me. It's my favorite for how comfortable it feels. I look good in it anyways, so I would rather keep it on, it reminds that I am still myself. That's my girl, you are stronger than you think, get good sleep in your nice stunning outfit, good night Sarah. <laughs> 